The mission of the Reproductive Endocrinology and Infertility Program is to train fellows who ideally would like to stay in academic medicine if possible and ask questions about reproductive issues that expand from the areas of endometriosis to polycystic ovarian syndrome, and then what many people equate with infertility, which is in vitro fertilization. Our REI Fellowship Program is a three-year program. We start with 18 months of clinical work, seeing patients and doing surgeries. The first half of the second year is spent in a private clinic, again doing multiple procedures and seeing patients in the clinical setting. During those six months in the first year, fellows will also do surgeries with the UCLA attendings as well. And then in the last 18 months, the time is spent in whatever lab the fellow chooses to do their thesis project in. The opportunities as an REI Fellow are expansive. We get the opportunity to rotate in a diverse number of rotations. For example, I recently did the male andrology rotation where I learned about male infertility, and now I'm on the endocrine um, rotation where I'm with diabetes and thyroid issues. The depth of the type of investigations that go on all across the campus, particularly in the basic sciences, is in my mind unsurpassed. We've had previous fellows who have worked in mouse laboratories studying mouse ovarian development. And those opportunities I don't think exist at very many other places. I think one of the unique things about this program is just being at a big academic center that's in a really diverse urban city. And I think that that lets us see such a great range of patients, you know, from gender diverse patients to oncofertility patients, interesting genetic cases, complex medical patients, in addition to just your standard bread and butter infertility and reproductive endocrinology patients. One special component of our program is our weekly didactics, in which we review chapters of Spiroff every Monday and our attendance are all there to ask us questions, to teach us, and I think that training is hard to find as a fellow, and it's important that your attendings are involved in teaching. I think the thing that makes the program the most unique at UCLA is the collaboration that we have just within the program itself. There's a lot of collaboration that happens both within the Department of OBGYN and all the other subspecialties, for instance, gynecologic oncology, and then also within reproductive urology, a lot of the other endocrine subspecialties. So there's definitely a lot of collaboration happening both within our department and within the broader UCLA campus. It's truly a family, and I think that all of the fellows feel like they're well supported and that all of the faculty are very much into it to make the fellows the best possible doctor that they can be. I actually trained at this program, both for my residency and fellowship, and then stayed on as faculty. This program holds a special place in my heart, and I think it's really fun to be on the other side of that now and kind of see things progress and change over time. I've been here since I was a resident, and I think that I've just been able to see the program blossom and, and see how many successful graduates we have from this program. I am proud to be part of this program for a whole bunch of reasons, but one of the main reasons is I really look up to my faculty in terms of mentors and friends and people, and I feel that I want to become them someday. You see yourself. You see yourself. You see yourself healing the world. You see yourself here. 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 UCLA, UCLA Reproductive, Reproductive Endocrinology and Infertility. And infertility.